Dangerous to be in the box if you're pitching to this guy. Juan Soto joins us, Padre superstar. What's up, Juan? Good to see you again. My swarmer. <laughs> oh, we've got gifts. We got I love gift. it. We Thank got you. Uh, we you. got trading Finally, cards from Tops. I love it. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Finally, we have someone bringing us gifts. That's what I love. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> That's what I love. Um, <laughs> hey, it's great to see you again, man. And and uh, for you, you know, obviously the team got off to a slow start. You guys are playing much much better, and you're red red hot. What's been the biggest difference, do you think, Juan? Uh, for us, it just uh, it just been tough, you know. The the crowd, everything, it just whatever it is, it's baseball. It just happens sometimes. We just gotta go out there and play hard and forget about all the comments and everything. So tell me a little bit about the San Diego. Everyone says you know it's the perfect weather in San Diego. It's a relaxed city. It's new for you. How are you enjoying it off the field, not necessarily just on the field? How are you enjoying the fan base? in San Diego. It's incredible, man. It's just unbelievable, like you say, 75 and sunny every day. Uh, it's really nice. The people there is really amazing. They, I have neighbors and everything. They bring me gifts and all the kind of stuff. I'm like, this, this is what you're looking for. I mean, What kind of gift? What do they bring you? Uh, they, I have a little neighbors. Uh, they, they make grapes and everything. Okay. They bring it from Mexico, so they, right. they give it to me. And this is unbelievable. I, I love it. Uh, the city, the restaurants, everything. It's just incredible city. Hey, Juan, KB just mentioned how good you've been lately. What do you think? How would you describe to the fans at home a little bit of your struggles? What's been the adjustment of why you've gone so red hot? Just the mechanics. I've been working on all my mechanics and everything, trying to figure out my path, my swing, uh, how to make contact with the ball and everything. You know, you, you've been there. just. You just got to click one time and then you're going to feel Which part out of your mechanics? I feel like uh, I was working by upper body. Uh, right. My lower body was kind of like uh, following my upper body a little bit. It was going a little bit too quick and now it's just finding my path again, swinging the ball well. And he's just, he just right there right now. Got I got another of my boys right here. Got Ronald Acuna <laughs> Jr. joining us as well. Hey, Acuna. Dile que tiene su facial. Look at the face. <laughs> what happened? <laughs> you look like Aira. <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait, wait. El calor. I wish, Papi. I wish. Hey, you know what? Con los dos, siéntate ahí. Yeah. Now, now that you're talking about mechanics, <laughs> Soto, now that Soto was talking about mechanic, I have some breaking news. I just bought a property in a building in the Dominican Republic, and I bumped into Soto's mom the other day. So me and Soto, we're going to be neighbors. Now, my question is, you want me to start working on the batting cage area so we can work it in the off season? <laughs> You can make it. I, I will go. I will go. I'll make I'll it happen promise. for you, baby. Yeah. I'll make it happen. Dime de ti. Tranquilo, tú sabes, disfrutando aquí el día a día, esperando la segunda mitad para seguir el mismo trabajo. Tú sabes, clasifica para los playoffs. My boy just say that he's working on a daily basis, you know, trying to get better every day and uh, having fun. That's the most important thing. Acuña, explícame tú la... La, la diferencia, el año que tú no jugaste en la Serie Mundial, yo sabía que tú querías estar afuera. ¿Qué hizo eso para ti y qué es la diferencia que tú estás encendido este año? Mira, el trabajo que he venido haciendo con el papá de Tati, yo trabajé mucho con el papá de Tati en Dominicana. Yo creo que me enseñó un par de ti. Yo no batía a ti, nunca había batido a ti. Y yo creo que eso es lo que influyó mucho a mí este año, que me, me mantenido con la consistencia. He said that he worked with Fernando Tati Jr.'s father eh, during the offseason in the Dominican Republic. And that helped him out a lot with his swing, his balance, you know, his mindset. And that's why he's going through what he's going through right now. That's so interesting. And speaking of Fernando Tatis, I want to talk about Junior. Because from you, knowing what it's like to play the outfield, what he's done this year has been incredible in right field, right? I mean, it's been an unbelievable transition oh, for him to learn right field and become one of the better right fielders in the game. Yeah, it's incredible, and uh, he's a quick learner too. Like everything that you tell him, he listens to you. He he's looking, he's looking forward to to learn every day. He's out there every day working on his outfield mechanics and everything. And I'm impressed what he's been doing. I mean, he's a great athlete. He's flying out of the bases, but he's flying in the outfield too. I think he's a great. He's he's one of the greatest out there right now, and he's gonna be it for a long time. To so both of you. You'll translate my Espanol is no bueno. <laughs> <laughs> Give me a reason why 
San Diego Padres and a reason why the Atlanta Braves win a championship this year. Entendite. La razón, la razón por la cual ustedes entienden que ustedes van a ganar la Serie Mundial. Well, 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 you speak, well, hold on, you, you, you speak the English. Yeah. Comprende, yeah. Comprende. Yeah. comprende. Él pica, él pica. Él pica. <laughs> Mira, yo creo que San Diego no sé, porque eh, ¿cómo que va, San Diego no sé? para ganar una Serie Mundial tienen que ganar nosotros primero. ¿Me entiendes? Yo creo que nosotros pasamos. tenemos buen equipo, hemos venido haciendo buen trabajo. Yo creo que con el Ford de ellos, yo creo que este año nos metemos para la Serie Mundial otra vez. Eh, eh, he said that... He don't know about San Diego. They got to beat him first. <laughs> but they had a, a, a team that is very compact. You know, they they have good pitching. They Their offense has been unbelievable. And they just are working on trying to stay healthy, you know, so they can get through the season. And Juan, what's your answer? I think San, uh, San Diego is, we have, we have everything that we need to go all the way uh, to the World Series and win it. Uh, we just got to get it together, play hard, and beat the Braves, I think. We've done it this year already. We've done it this year already. We win the series already. So I think we just we just got to go out there and play good baseball. You know, it's just no, it's, gonna, it's not going to be easy series or anything. We just got to go out there and play hard to everything and try to beat everybody. All right, before we get into a WD <laughs> WrestleMania here between you two. <laughs> Papa, dime dos situaciones que tú te guste de Juan Soto, de que tú admiras del juego de él. Mira, yo creo que la paciencia que él tiene para cuando va a batear. Yo cada vez que él va a batear, yo siento que él va a hacer algo, ¿me entiendes? La manera como él agarra los picheos, lo fácil que él hace que se vean los picheos, que yo sé que no es fácil, yo creo, yo alguna vez quisiera tener ese talento. So I said two things, Acuna, that you admire about Juan Soto, and he said one is the discipline and poise, and then the ability to hit for power. Same question, Juan, about this young man. I feel like uh, his speed, he's just incredible, the speed he has, and uh, how much baseball IQ he has in the bases, he's just unbelievable. I feel like... That's one of the things I admire most, and every time he's in second base, believe me, I'm right behind the shortstop. If the ball hit it at me, just make sure I can throw him out at the play. So I think that's one of the things I admire most, like his IQ running the bases and how fast he is. Uh, Ronald, I have a question. So Poppy just said that he's going to be neighbors with uh, Juan's family down in the Dominican Republic. Do you want to be a neighbor with this guy? He already know. We love <laughs> Rochi every day. <laughs> <laughs> Believe me, that apartment looks like a. Hey, when you come to Dominican, uh, you stay with me, like and we're having us a neighbor. All, all you know is you better bring him gifts like his current neighbors in San Diego. Uh, <laughs> two of the absolute stars of the game: Ronald Acuna Jr. of the Braves, Juan Soto of the Padres. Guys, great to see you. Good luck yeah. and have fun tomorrow. Okay. Thank what you. a pleasure. There you go. What you a great shot muchachos. of these guys on the stage with us, and we have more to do as the All Star Game from Seattle continues. Hey, Mookie, Betts stop by. Said hello to this guy, Poppy. And we've got more to do, more guests as well as the show rolls out. Oh, we got time for a selfie. Get in there. <laughs>